create a dead butt with a roller, okay? So the setup of this is I'm gonna take the roller, I'm gonna put it on the front side of my foot, same side of arm, I'm gonna put my hand on the back side of the roller, okay? So like if I had somebody who's come up, try to slap this away, they shouldn't be able to do that. Like, obviously that just happened, but you wanna be pulling up with the knee and pushing down with the hand, not crushing the roller yet, um, but enough pressure that if somebody comes back through the neck to be able to slap that and move that away. Okay. Opposite leg, it's not touching the roller, and opposite arm that's not touching the roller, they're gonna be up towards the ceiling like so. Okay. From here, what you're gonna do, you got low back is down to the floor. Even as I hold this position here, I can very mildly feel my abs working, like I can feel some tension there. That's gonna increase here in a second. We're gonna inhale. As we go out through the arm and leg, you're only going to go as far as you can control your low back position. So if you reach back and you lose that contact, I don't know if you can see the video right now, but like I'm just marching my back and lost contact on the floor, that's too far. Okay, so I want to stop before that happens. Inhale, and then I'm going to exhale through the mouth. Crush the roller and exhale. So what I mean by crushed roller is I'm gonna push down my hand, I'm gonna pull up my knee, so I'm creating more compressive force into the roller. I'm gonna do that as I exhale, and then you're gonna really feel apt working as you do that. So without being interrupted and explaining everything, I'll show you what a full repetition is like. So here. And notice as I bring my arm and leg back up to start, I finish the exhale or I go into my next repetition. I don't want you to rush it with your hyperventilating. You should take a good, about anywhere from four to six seconds to do an exhalation and come back up. Um, again, lots of abs, make sure you can pull back on the ground. Should be all good to go.